Hello everybody, I am Fedora Gamer, and it's time for another Loot Crate. I just got in my July Loot Crate, which is of the theme villains. Uh, I do know ahead of time that there is another, another t-shirt in this one. They announced that right after the last one, so that's three months of t-shirts in a row. Uh, normal disclaimer, if you have a Loot Crate subscription and not received yours yet, do not watch this video. It ruins it for you. That's the magic of Loot Crate, is opening it. You've been warned. Alright, first off... Notably, this is a considerably different size than normal. It's much larger, but yet a little shallower than normal. It's very strange. Also, looks like somebody at the U.S. Post Office decided to sit on it for me because the post office is bloody terrible. So, let's go ahead and get right into it. Villains, let's see what we have here. We start with the t-shirt. It's Joker mixed with somebody else that I'm not putting my finger on right now. Let's let's open it up here. Oh, it's Jokey. It's Loki mixed with Joker. Okay, that's they they love their crossover art at at uh, Loot Crate, and I can appreciate that. Okay, put that one aside. Oh, geez, look at the inside of the box. Let's give a review of it here. That's quite creative. What we have here, we have Deadpool socks. We have Deadpool socks. I will definitely wear these. I don't care. What is this? this I find this interesting. I can get it out of this thing here. Oh, that's a Harley Quinn and Joker poster. This is freaking awesome. Look at this. This is pretty damn sweet. You know, I don't think any of the crates I've got before had a poster, and even though this is a, not a full-size poster, it's like a strip poster, but that is cool. I'm going to stick that back in the plastic here so I don't get it. I'm not going to be able to fit it back in the plastic, especially not from behind a phone camera. We have a magnet of Bowser. Should have known Bowser would be in villains. Pretty much the original game villain. We have... A Darth Vader keychain, which another another nerd classic villain that I should have expected would be in there. Actually, I did expect it would be in there. There would be something from Darth Vader. What do we have here? It's a CD. I don't, I'm not sure what this is. And it's very, very shrink wrapped. But I think it's a CD. Find something to open it with here. I don't have anything sharp nearby. Yes, I do. We have the the button here. Focus, please. Focus, camera. That's the villain button. And I am stabbing the shrink wrap with this to open that up. Because I'm resourceful like that. Alright, trash, be gone. It is a CD. Necessary Evil Supervillains of DC Comics. This is a DVD. So, it's a movie or episode of something. At least an episode of something. Well, I'm going to have to check that out. This one is shaping up to be pretty awesome. Okay, we saw the pen. And here is the, the zine that goes with the, the loot crates. Last month they tried a digital zine, but a lot of people were freaking out about that, so... They are going 
Back to the normal zine. This is... Oh, they have a an interview with a Marvel artist. That's, uh, top five video game villains. Getting from Legend of Zelda, I'd agree with that. And this is this month's Mega Crate. I just want that's why I wanted to see in here is the Mega Crate. Marvel Lebit Venom figurine. I don't know what that is. 60 inch LED TV. Okay, that would have been pretty amazing. And some nice gaming headsets. Maybe some month I'll win that one. Alright, and that's that's the zine. Holy crap, and there's actually a comic book in here too. Rocket Raccoon comic book. In wrap and everything. I'm not I don't know if I'm gonna take it out of the wrap right now. There's a full-out comic book, Rocket Raccoon from Guardians of the Universe, which is, you know, a, a big thing getting hyped up lately, so that's pretty cool, which is, it's a Loot Crate exclusive one, obviously, Raccoon's holding a Loot Crate. So, recap, comic book, the zine, which is, you know, normal, the really cool poster, that's amazing. Which, I need to roll it up better. I need to hang that up, so I need DVD. Vader keychain. Bowser magnet. Deadpool socks. The button. And the t-shirt that I tossed out of my range right now. So, I can't really recap that. But that is this month's Loot Crate. I rather liked last month's Loot Crate, but I think this one tops it. This is a really awesome Loot Crate. It was pretty damn badass. I'm Victoria Gamer. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in getting your own Loot Crates, there is a link in the description where you can go and sign up for Loot Crate, which it's less than 20 bucks a month for all this cool stuff. I think it's absolutely worth it. There's been a few crates that I didn't like very much, but none of them have left me feeling it wasn't worth the money. So, that's just my take, though. Anyway, if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.